Uh, hello, and welcome to Shuffle Play. Uh, this is the feature where uh, I basically have all these different game libraries, I'm sure many of us do, uh, where there's maybe hundreds of games in there at this point, uh, and basically draw three at random and try them out for 15 minutes. Um, yeah, hope you enjoy. I need to eat more food. And what we'll be playing is... No Man's Sky. All right. Yeah, cool. We're going to be playing No Man's Sky. So uh, just in case you haven't heard of it or are not as familiar, uh, computer, tell me about No Man's Sky. Inspired by the adventure and imagination that we love from classic science fiction, No Man's Sky presents you with a galaxy to explore filled with unique planets and life forms and constant danger and action. In No Man's Sky, every star is the light of a distant sun, each orbited by planets filled with life, and you can go to any of them you choose. Fly smoothly from deep space to planetary surfaces with no loading screens and no limits. In this infinite procedurally generated universe, you'll discover places and creatures that no other players have seen before, and perhaps never will again. Now including, play with all major updates at launch, Foundation, Pathfinder, Atlas Rises, Next, The Abyss, Visions, The 2.0 Beyond, Update, Synthesis, Living Ship, Exomac, Desolation, and the latest 3.0 update, Origins. Yeah, so uh, this game came out, just broader context, and um, you, stop me if you've heard this before. Uh, the gamers were upset, um, <laughs> and... Uh, but, you know, the team had enough money that they could keep going. And as you can see at the end of this description, they have put out update after update after update after update. Uh, this game continues to expand. Um, I hopped in there um, after one of those updates, and I had a pretty good time. There, There's a stretch of a weekend right after I graduated college where I was <laughs> just playing No Man's Sky and watching Dragon Ball Super pretty much the entire weekend. Um, yeah. So let's hop into it. Let's check out some No Man's Sky. I did have a different desktop at one point, um, but uh, I think it got reset after I reset the computer or something. I don't know. All right, play a game. Um, I think I should hop into a new game. I think that makes the most sense. Um, yeah, let's do normal. So uh, I believe we're going to hop into a large loading screen here. Any second now. Um, space. There it is. Cool. I'm going to sneeze really quick. Excuse me. <coughs> ah. Okay, so I see we're beginning to lose frames. Um, so <laughs> hopefully this goes away once the game comes back up. Um, for that other save that was here, I did say to lower the graphics settings. I don't know if that's going to carry over to the save that we're currently seeing or not. Um, hopefully, but if not, I will have to restart the game. So as soon as I hop in, we'll check the graphic settings and then we'll hop back out or something. And then we'll properly start the timer. These are some pretty good generated names, I gotta say. I would love to know the uh, the system behind that. I'm sure they have like some sort of grammar rules that they're following, right? 
it's probably simpler than you think it would be. It's <laughs> usually how it goes. Uh, yeah, let's let's begin. Hello. Okay, so this planet is cold, it's a little radioactive, and it looks like there it is toxic. So I think this is maybe not the best uh, pull of the slot, but this will be a little different. This will be cool. Okay, we're doing the uh, little spin around. Can I? I cannot access the graphics yet. Okay. They need me to see my equipment. Okay. And gun's gonna clunk clunk. No. All right, we're in. Um. Tab to skip. Cool. So I'm gonna go to the options. Let's check out these graphic settings. Um, okay, yeah, it looks like these are low enough, so we're good. Um, it is filling up my whole monitor, which is a bit taller than the stream, but I think that's gonna be okay. Um, maybe that's video options. Let's try bordered. Apply. Cool. I think that should fit a little better. Just in case there's some UI at the top or bottom that is getting cut off. Okay, cool. So I'm going to start the timer. Let's check out some No Man's Sky. Oh, okay, so that's how you mine. I think I played this with a gas... Uh, did I say gas? Why did I say gas? With a uh, game controller last time. So I'm just going to mine some of that up. Um, how do I analyze? Can I analyze things yet? Um, activate the scanner with C, that's how. Okay. Oh no, I need more ferrite. Okay. Time to just <laughs> get all this ferrite. Um, still don't have enough of my scanner. Okay. So I'm sure they'll bug us at some point, but uh, if you keep just uh, messing with these planets, eventually the, I believe they're called the Sentinels, these robots come and get you. Oh no, where's my spaceship? Oh no, I'm getting too cold. Where's my spaceship? Um. Starship, I saw it, I saw it. Uh, starship out of range. Oh, oh no. Okay, got dihydrogen. Love to have dihydrogen. Take some rusted metal. Um, uh oh, oh no. Okay, <laughs> game crashed. Um, let's, let's hop back in there. It's a bummer. I guess I'll pause the timer. This gives me time to think about, um, how I'm going to get out of the cold. I don't think I've spawned on a cold planet before. It was always like, um, either a nice temperate, uh, weather situation, or maybe the air was like a little toxic, but. I always had my ship, so I could um, <laughs> just get back to my ship, and that was okay. Oh, it looks like it might be just making a whole new planet, actually. So maybe I don't need to worry about that. That's fine, too. I think this time I'll try playing with a gamepad. Um, just see if any muscle memory comes back to me. Uh, 
Okay. So just gonna check the stream before uh, I continue again, because it looks like I'm losing frames from what I'm seeing again. Just wanna check everything's fine. And I wanna see, begin initialization on my screen there. Hmm, not seeing it yet. Okay, there we go. I think we're all set. So, I'm hit play again. Let's hop back into it. So are we still on that ice planet or are we somewhere new? This looks... Oh, it's a new, it's a new snowy planet. Okay. Still cold, still somewhat radioactive, still kind of toxic. Okay. There's some vegetation nearby though, that's cool. Oh wow, it's a big structure right there. Okay. some ferrite dust. I think we'll make our way towards that big structure in case we uh, need to get out of the cold. That seems like a good bet. Uh, what are those? Let's get all these things. They seem neat. Um, I want to say there's like a ancient race of aliens that you slowly discover. Um, I don't have a visor yet. And they have these kind of stones that look like those, but much larger. Just getting a little more ferrite. I don't know if it'll be enough for my scanner, but I'd like to be able to make it up there. Oh, I do have a jetpack. Maybe I can make this jump. Uh, this seems like a bad idea. No, oh no. Okay. Maybe there's a ground entrance. Hello aliens, please take pity on me. I'm an idiot in out in the cold without a ship. Please let me inside. Okay, I almost have enough ferrite. Just gonna grab a little bit more. Hopefully that's enough now. I think it is. So we're gonna repair our scanner. And we are taking cold damage now. <laughs> almost inside. Oh, everything's fogging up. Ice and over. No good. Let me in. <laughs> Let me in. <laughs> okay. So it seems like the proper way to solve this is I get sodium from plants, but I'm I feel like it should work that if I run inside it should help me out or something, right? Ah, oh, yeah, thank goodness it is working. Okay, we're good. Oh no, 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 no. Why is it going down again? How about now? There we go. That's what I wanted, okay. Spawning next to an outpost, good thing. Okay. So I haven't learned any of these words yet. Um, that's another thing in this game is um, you can slowly learn words of the other species. Um, in my experience of playing for a good number of hours, it was always um, pretty similar to my experience trying to learn other languages in general where, you know, you'll 
pick up a lot of words, but in the actual sentence being thrown at you, it's like, I know two of those, and that doesn't really give me much the context, but I know those two words. And uh, yeah, so like different aliens come by with their different ships and um, you can try to like buy the ship off them. <laughs> I just started this game, so there's no way that I can even attempt to do any of that. Um, yeah, let's get some sodium so we can actually get our thermal uh, stuff up to par on this ice planet. Let's hop on down. Okay, that has carbon. Okay, it's sodium. There's sodium. Um, okay, I don't have my analysis visor yet. That's another thing that you're doing a lot in this game is you are uh, just kind of analyzing the different uh, creatures and material uh, minerals that you come across on these planets. Pretty neat. And then I think you get um, credit for those discoveries as well. Um, I don't know how that works now that there's like actually multiplayer in the game, but seems cool. Okay, well these are dihydrogen, not sodium. Where is that sodium? Sodium. That's carbon, ferrite. Oh, there's some really far over there. I thought we were headed straight to some fresh sodium or something. It's a bummer if not. Okay. I guess we'll go this long way and hope it pans out. Not a big deal if it doesn't, I suppose. There's sodium, that one flower over there. I'm just <laughs> Skyrim running on this mountain wall. Hope I don't fall. Cool. Here's some snow. <laughs> Picking the plant. Nice. We have sodium. Um, and can I recharge this now with some sodium? Yes, I can. It needs mm -hmm. some energy or something, maybe? Let's see. Hmm. All right, I'm going to begin my, uh... <laughs> Long walk up. Oh, there's a distress signal. I would like to check that out. Where is that? Down there? Easy. We'll just <laughs> stumble down this mountain. There we go. What is this thing? Sweet root. Right on. And what is that thing? This is the No Man's Sky experience. What is that? What's that? What's that? What's that? Deuterium. Deuterium is good, I believe. And then hopefully those are friendly. Turpunk, turpunk, yig, yig, yig. Oh, I accept this knowledge. Uh huh. Hey, I learned the word for Viking. And distress beacon's over there. I'm just gonna grab some sodium really quick because this planet's cold. And then maybe some uh, oxygen. Because I like to breathe. Okay. Distress beacon. Let's check it out.
Some damaged machinery. Um, gotta just take out that goop. You don't need that goop. Uh, I forget, how do I junk this? I guess I'll put it in my junk seat. Okay, got some nanites, and let's check out this distress beacon. Oh. Mm-hmm. Is it gonna sky beam or okay, no, I guess it just transmitted, that's okay. And this seems like a ship. How bad is this ship uh damaged? Okay, can't fly. Engine's not working. <laughs> Oh. I guess it's my ship. Yeah, I'm down. Let's let's repair this ship. Okay, so we need hermetic seal and metal plating. Uh how do we build any of that? Pure ferrite, dihydrogen jelly. Dope, 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 dope. Uh, this needs metal plating. That needs a hermetic seal. How do I build those? I'm trying to remember if the game tells me. Okay, no, it does. It says craft product. So, metal plating, you just need a lot of ferrite dust. And how about a hermetic seal? Do I have that knowledge? I might not. Okay. So we definitely need more dihydrogen, I'm going to say, and ferrite. So let's go get some ferrite. That's easy enough. Okay. So now we have enough for the plate. I feel like hopping in the ship. Cool, hopping the ship does protect us from the outside. Good. All right, so let's build that metal plating. And install that. And next up is the hermetic seal. How do? Yeah, please, please help. Request assistance. A salvage miser or distress beacon. Okay. Oh, it's right there. Easy peasy. Let me add it. Okay, so that was time. Um, I guess I'll just activate this distress beacon and then we'll, I guess, end it there. Maybe we can repair that one system. Give me the planetary chart. Um, oh, I see. So, let me hop on the ship, activate the chart. Uh, activate the chart. Does it not work if I'm in the ship? Oh, no, it's right here. Okay. Whoa. And then I think it like goes back down, right? Zroom. Boop. And then, yeah, I think that finds nearby buildings and things to check out. Cool. So yeah, that's been No Man's Sky. Uh, I'm gonna Alt F4 out of here. There we go. Uh, I, I noticed some hitches in the stream, but I think it's been okay. Hopefully it has been. Um, yeah, thanks for tuning in, everyone that tuned in. Oh, you can see that. Um, yeah, have a good one out there. Stay safe. Um, it's going to be a weird holiday, but 
it's still, still going to be, be holiday for festive and we're uh, alive for it. So, yeah, see you around. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed, uh, please subscribe, hit the bell to get notified, like, comment, all that good stuff. Uh, follow me on various social media if that's of interest. And of course, please check out the awesome games that are being uh, played on this feature. Um, so many hours are going into this that I'm just covering for like 15 minutes. Uh, so please check those out. Um, yeah, and I'll see you next time.